tell you where the fish are. Triple, triple. Get in there. Ooh, that's a nice fish. Yeah, yeah man. Bam. Bam. Come on. Make it clear. 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 Make it Hey everybody, Chris Schaefer of Potsky Outdoors. Today we're coming to you from Virginia. We're on the Virginia Beach Pier here today. A very popular place, very popular place for crabbing. And things have been a little bit more difficult than they normally are simply because it's so hot out here today. But we're gonna show you how you can use blue crab fuel when things get tough and increase your catches with crabs. All right, we got the chicken brine here in the, in the blue crab fuel. Uh, we put that in overnight. Uh, so we did about 10 o'clock last night. So it's been, you know, a good uh, 15 hours probably. Um, so obviously it's taken into the meat really well. Look at that. It's actually neon blue. I scored the meat up a little bit, put a little slit in there to make the uh, chicken easier to attach to the trap. And we'll see what happens. All right, so we're just gonna attach this chicken here to the trap. Just using a simple piece of string. You can use whatever you want. Zip tie, a little twist tie from your old bread bag, whatever you wanna use. So it's something to secure it on there where they can't steal your bait. to keep it close. Right. Looks like a little better one. They're growing. Slowly. Still needs some of that. Still wants the blue. This guy's coming to life. We're sitting here on the Virginia Beach Pier, so we're right in the heart of it all. Uh, and what's amazing about it is, you'll have tens of thousands of people literally uh, swimming in the water, uh, body surfing, um, you know, on boat tours, hanging out on the beach, and just completely unaware of the fact that this area is absolutely loaded with blue crabs. Now. Uh, today wasn't the greatest day for blue crabs. Unfortunately, this week it's been extremely hot. And what I mean by that is it's been anywhere from 95 to 99 degrees, um, upwards of very high humidity levels as well. And what happens uh, during the day when that goes on is the crabs just don't bite as well. Uh, so we had to work a little bit harder today. You know, we, uh, we saw fish reports here last week that crabbing was very good. The temperature is about 15 degrees cooler. Uh, so unfortunately, when we came, uh, they told us the, the crabbing bite had really slowed down. Just gonna add a little more bait to this trap just to freshen it up a bit. You can see these other two pieces of uh, some of the brine is released from it, but it's still down in the meat, as you see there. But uh, we're gonna definitely just add some more fresh chicken wings soaked, just to see if it'll draw up a little more excitement. Oh yeah, we got another good one. This might be the best one of the day so far. Look at him chowing up the blue crab fuel. Bam! Now that's why we come to Virginia. Shoo.